guys, what's up? It's me, Sam33 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. In the last part, we grew trees, and we fought big actos, and none of it was enjoyable. And in this part, we're going to do some side quest thingies, like get a piece of hearts and treasure charts and that stuff. So, today we have, we're going to go to Blime Island, Samantha's Oasis, Angular Isles, uh... Spectacle Island, uh, let me get the list out, uh, Rock Spire Island, Isle, whatever, um, Windfall, our good friend, and, uh, what else, Pitstone Island, probably gonna go to all those places, just, you know, save you guys some time, some days of boringness. Alright, so anyway, fast forward, we're gonna go ahead to Bomb Island. Now, you may see in that uh, beam of light coming out of the sea that we should probably be getting, but I will neglect to get those. I'll save all the ones we haven't gotten for another video and just do it later. Yeah. So here we got one of the Gorons. Hey, guy. I'm gonna... Steal your hat. Oh. Boo. I wanted to steal your hat. I guess not! So yeah, this place, we've probably been here before a long, long time ago. Back before we were able to change the wind direction. Not, we could change the wind direction, but we couldn't go to wherever we wanted on the sea. And we didn't have bombs. And now we have bombs, we can just go inside. It's pretty that simple. Woohoo. Yeah. A lot of the islands you go to early on that you need stuff for, you just don't think about again. Until that time where you... Oh, I will kill you. Uh, yeah. Just don't think about it. But yeah, we gotta use the uh, snake things. I think they're called like magnet tails or something. Because that's what it says in the guide I'm looking at. Uh, so yeah, just gotta put them on the switch, and weigh them down so we can go to places. So where is a magnet tail? There's a switch here. Oh, we don't have a magnet tail. No! <sighs> Splendid. Great way to start off today. Falling in lava. Where are they? I'll get you to come out. Or can we just, like, sit on the switch? I know, it's that easy. It can't be that easy. It can't be a weighted switch. No, you are a badly designed game. Why is the switch even in? You must have. You must need a friggin' magtail. Why else would they put the little slopes on the on the thing? Or like the, Why would they make the switch go down like this? Like be an old uh, crater. Let's see, I'm gonna get off of it. Oh, what? Then why is it in that freaking crater? It's just stupid. And annoying. And makes you fall off. Okay. So now... Come on. That's not what's actually happening. You're lying. Uh, okay, so we gotta... No. I wanna... Not... Okay. Let's hit this guy. No, I don't... A way, to, way to just ruin my life. Game, way to just do that. <sighs> okay. At least this is down. Okay. Oh. Oh, uh, it works now! Doesn't work the, when I attacked him while his pincers were open, but then when I attack him while his pincers are closed, it works perfectly friggin' fine! Back here. Get back here. Hard to get these guys to stop from falling off ledges. That's not what I want to happen, you devil of the suck. Yeah, I don't like this. I should probably kill some of these guys and just let the other one live. That is probably an easier way to do this because these guys are annoying as hell. 
Stab through the brain. You're dead. Now you. Okay, these things make absolutely no sense whatsoever. I can attack them from what looks to be the direct front, and they will supposedly block it with their pincers. But then I can attack them from the clear back. Oh, God, I hate this. I hate this. This is not a fun thing for me. This is just terrible. What is happening? I'm falling apart at the seams. Why? Uh, th okay, this is just a stupid place in general. These slopes, why would they make these so narrow? That's just horrible. Like, they designed this place to friggin' make you hate it. I have a better idea. Let's kill this one. This one's harder to grab. Don't fall off. Why would you come at this angle? You weren't at that angle. The monster wasn't at the angle. You're just stupid. That's what it is. What? <sighs> this is sad. This is really sad. We were supposed to get like 10 things in this episode, and I can't even get this one. That's a great start. We'll probably only get like five. Probably not even that. Okay. Let's just like do this. We can just like do this, right? Just throw this. Land on the button, please. Thank you. Okay. Now, hopefully, this will work. Eh. Uh, did it work? It better have worked or I'm going to murder you. Please tell me that they're not going to make the fire go away. They didn't! Yay! Woo! And what is in here? It's probably gonna be a piece of part. Whoop buddy doo da. <sighs> God. Magma tails. You suck. All right. Whoop 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 Oh no, the door's locked. It's so threatening, except it's not. Alright, now on to whatever is west of here. I forgot what it was. Rocks? Not the rocks fire. Uh, stone watcher? No. Um, Samantha's Oasis, of course. Of course, of course. Fast forward. Ah, uh, home sweet home. Except it's not really our home, it's just our private oasis that's... It's like our beach house. Or island house, or whatever. Boop. Okay, well, let's just skip the nonsense and get up there. Or that could happen. Said skip the nonsense, not do only the nonsense. Okay, that's total bullcrap. <laughs> Come on. I don't feel like going to the land. Thank you. Alright. Now we're on this island. And it's not in the actual oasis itself for the cabana that the treasure is there, but it's actually behind the cabana. We can use Le Hook Shot go up here. And it looks to be a chest. Ta-da! I didn't know this was here, but it's here. <laughs> Treasure chart! It's in a spiky chest for no apparent reason. Woohoo. It's like the one treasure chart that's in a spiky chest. I think you can like... No, I thought there was like a secret hole down there. Woo. Okay, now we're gonna head south to Angular Islands. That's the island with all the blocks. That is blocks. I am your sandwich. Alright. Fasty forward. Looks like I'm running out of things to say. Woohoo. Back on Angular Islands. Stop! Get out. Now, as you recall, we I believe we got to the top of this place, and we couldn't 
do anything, because we required the ability to use light, and we have since gained the ability to use light. So, yeah, we're gonna need to use the mirror shield. You know, that part back there, we pushed out the block, and then you can't, you have to have like half full art. That reminds me of the game Catherine. Has anyone ever heard of that? It's a uh, PS3, Xbox 360 game. It's like a sort of dating sim sort of puzzle game thing. Oh god, go away. It's not as lame as it sounds, but uh, it's actually a cool game. I kind of like it. I haven't played it, but I've seen people play it. And you like put blocks, and there's this constant sound of this person saying edge whenever a block like falls onto a net. It's weird, I don't know. It's uh, it's an interesting game. You guys should check it out. I'm sure it's e equally fun to watch as it is to play. I mean, puzzle games are fun to watch. It's weird. It's like the weirdest combination. Like, puzzle games are fun to play, but not to watch. And then the dating sim part. It's not, it's not even really a dating sim. It's like a. It's like a. What, what do you got? Like it's like a pick your own adventure story. Not really. That's really like adult. No, no cleaner way to put it. But yeah, block puzzles. Yay. Uh, these are. This one's kind of crazy. I don't remember how to do this one. Um, pretty sure I'm doing it wrong already. Oh, that seemed to have worked. Oh, I think we did it. I think? Maybe? Yes. I did it. Alright, so now... I can climb, climb up the stupid thing. There's a chest here, which we need to form into existence. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's what I think. I swear to God. You know what I'm thinking of. Okay, thank the Lord. It's not a freaking joy pendant. Oh, what just happened? Whoa. That's cool. But kind of pointless. Anyway, back to the surface. I thought I saw in the piece of heart list that it was that there was one on that there's a piece of heart on this island. I'm like, oh right, it's the mirror shield thing. But then I'm like, oh wait, there's already a piece of heart that we got on this island. It's up there. All right, where are we going now? Um, we're gonna go to Windfall and then Spectacle and then probably Rock Spire and then maybe call it a day. I don't know. We'll do stuff. Yeah. Um, I have Pepsi this time. I have prepared. I mean, I noticed last episode I was incredibly tired. I'm still very tired, but now I have Pepsi, which will make me less tired. Pepsi is delicious, by the way. I love Pepsi. Pepsi is probably my favorite soda. Mmm. So good. I also love Mountain Dew. Both are incredibly delicious. That's Coke. I also kind of like the only one that's like really cold, like an icy Coke is incredible, but a regular Coke is not incredible. It's like, okay. I don't know, I've grown to like it. But, uh, here we, are. we gotta do a side quest here. I'm pretty sure we haven't done this before. I don't think we have. But basically there's this, uh, there's this girl. Uh, we've, we've taken pictures of her before. There's a whole picture box thing. Oh, what do you think about my outfit? Don't you see my clothes like often? Uh, aren't they so cute? A friend of mine who was looking outside to set this up with me. I don't know what I'm saying. It's an amazing girl. She can put her eyes on her head and walk around like there's nothing at all. You have seen her believe it. Yeah, I live there. You friggin' duts. Uh, yeah. We're gonna need to take a picture of her. I feel like we haven't done this. I, this seems like something. I know we've taken a picture of her before. Okay, stop. With the surrounding of me, stupid bees. Uh, yes, I got a shot without the stupid kids in them. And I believe you do need a uh, color pick to box for this. I don't think you can use a regular one. So, yeah, we got that. 
And you remember one of the pick the box things was we got a picture of that girl and this guy, uh, looking, uh, meeting eyes. And Valenta's like, oh, they have such, uh, chemistry. So if you show the picture to the guy, uh, you can, uh, show it him. And this happens. Oh, a pictograph, eh, buddy? Ah, this girl. Actually, buddy, this is the girl I've had my eye on lately. Wow, she really is that pretty. I mean, just seeing that pictograph reminds of how gorgeous that girl is. And it also reminds me of how much of a creep you are. Why do you have a picture of this random girl? But no, I'll never be happy with just a mere pictograph. Never! That's it. I've made my decision. I'm going to get that girl to out go out with me. It's gotta be done, buddy. I've got it. Maybe I'll invite her to join me at the cafe bar for coffee. Of course. So what's her name, anyway? You think she's nice? Does she have a uh, steady fellow? Oh, I'm so nervous! Okay, I think now we just, like, song of passing this baby. It's not right. Uh, there we go. I get it. We're ghoul. We're ghoul. Halloween puns. Oh, yeah, this is posted on the Halloween. Hope you guys have a happy Halloween. Halloween's fun. I enjoy it very much. I have no idea what I'm doing for Halloween, though. I'm probably just gonna, like... Hang out with friends. I like just bear. What am I doing? I like. I'm just past the age of trick or treating, but not past the age of dressing up. So I'm like, just like, oh, Halloween, it's cool, but I don't know why anymore. <laughs> no, I still love Halloween. I love dressing up, even if there's not as much candy or as long cold nights. I miss trick or treating. Trick or treating was fun. Now where do I go? What do I do again? Crap. Oh, I think I talked to her. Hey, I've heard something on my mind ever since the pictographer who lives in the red brick building told me my fortune. He told me that I should send a beautiful picture for myself to the one who has captured my heart. True love will blossom in return. So I couldn't help but notice that you have picked a box of your own, don't you? Didn't you take a picture of me to, uh, to the apple of my eye? Maybe he'll notice my affections. Uh, leave it to me. Really? Oh, how splendid. Be sure to get my good side. Oh, I want to show you this outfit so I don't take a picture of my face. Be sure to get my whole body in the picture. Okay, I'm confused. Hold on. I think I did something wrong. I don't think I, like, messed it up. What does this guy tell me? Uh, that's great. I've made up my mind first. I'm going to ask her the coffee then. Things are going to be bad. Uh, can't seem to settle down. I'm so nervous. I mean, just what I'm supposed to... Okay. Now I... Okay, I'm just gonna take a picture of her just to be sure. I don't think I have to because I already showed the picture to the guy. And I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to trigger this cutscene. Okay. Nice photo bombing, you jerks! Get out of here! Uh, now we fast forward. Should not fast forward. Uh, song passing, but we'll also cut to when it's daytime. Also Pepsi. Oh god, what's this? All right, we have returned, and <gasps> she's gone. What has he done with her? Oh, that guy! I'm gonna kill him. He's not. He didn't know what was coming with him. Where is he? Where is he? Where is she? Where are they? Ugh. Oh, they're at the coffee shop. That's wonderful. Oh, hey, it's you. Listen to this, will you? I did. IT! I worked up my courage, and I talked to her, and it was totally the right move. You know why, buddy? She likes me. She actually likes me. And I'll talk to you. The two of us are going to start dating. Don't we make a delightful couple? I'm so happy. That's why I want to share some of our happiness with you. Peace of hearts! I think there's no other form of happiness in this world. Like, no one ever talks about anything else when they talk about happiness. It's just like, oh... Happiness? Uh, I have a piece of heart. That's, that means happiness. I guess. Okay, uh, we're running so low on time. Whatever, let's just make this a long one. You know, side quests are boring. We'll cut them. We'll make some longer videos to cut down the amount of videos we're making. Alright. Just head to the boat, and then we're gonna head west to Spectacle Rock? Spectacle Island? I don't know. It's a place. But, no, Spectacle Rock is just like a rock in Zelda games. Like, you know the rock you blow up to get to Ganon's 
uh, layer in the first Zelda game. That's Spectacle Rock. There's also a rock in Zelda 2 that you hit with the hammer to get past. That's Spectacle Rock. Spectacle Rock is in, in some way, shape, or form in like a lot of Zelda games. It's like some random rock in Zora's Domain and Twilight Princess. I don't know where it is in uh, Ocarina of Time for this game. Let's just see. Island. I think Mother and Child Isle might be Spectacle Rock or something. I don't know. Fast forward. Alright, back on Spectacle Island. And apparently I'm stupid, but I'm not stupid. I'm stupid, but I'm not stupid. If you go back and watch the episode where I did the uh, Shooting Barrels minigame, he said, there might be some treasure, some alternate thing you can get here if you do it again, but I don't feel like doing it. Well, well, guess what? There's things, something you can get if you win this again. So I'm going to do that. I'm probably just going to skip this. I already did this before. Yeah. So, see so you guys when I beat this. Yes! Success! Psh! Wait a second! Miss! Miss! What do you want? Do you know how to keep quiet? Don't you... Ah, ah, you scurvy dog. Oh, I was just wondering who was out there. And look at this. It's you again. Look at you and that adorably cute face of yours. I can help give all of our treasure to you. It's yours, so take it. Hey, look, treasure chart. Yay! Blah, 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 unskippable text, blah, 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 unskippable text, blah, blah, blah. Alright, nice job on all that, you can leave the lad behind you, climb down in a really manner if you please. Nope! Oh, I didn't want to do that. Uh, no. Yeah, uh, orderly manner my foot. Yeah, we got a treasure chart. I'm gonna open it, and the other one, so I don't forget later. Um, there's that one. I think we need one more. Yep, 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 yep. There we go. Alright, now we're gonna head to, uh, Rock Spire Island, which is down here. So, let's go in that direction now. Fast forward, by the way. Just saying. Warships thingies out here. Basically, kill them. They drop nice and shiny things for us. Hopefully the other one won't shoot us down. Of course, you should not do that. Don't go farther than you're supposed to, you stupid thing. Stop! Eh. Get it. Yay, chest. By the way, that was not off sync. My reaction was just incredibly delayed, and this one has 100 rupees. I believe the other one has something of significance. So, yeah, where is it? It's over there, shooting me in the face and the rest of the body, probably breaking all of my bones and killing me. That is what happens usually when you get hit by a bomb when exploding, not just hit. I'm sure a bomb would hurt just by ramming into you in the first place, but yeah, it would also hurt if it exploded in your face. Stop moving. Yeah, there. <laughs> Chest. Woohoo. What is in this chest? I don't actually remember. I think it is a. Nope, I was wrong. That was a treasure chart. Woohoo. Piece of art. 
Alright, we got the pizza part. And that's going to do it for this episode of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time where we get more uh, cleanup. What else do we have to do? I don't remember. Um, most of what we're missing is, uh, like, uh, we're stuff we, uh, like, more difficult side quests and, uh, a lot, a lot, a lot of difficult side quests and, uh, like, story stuff and stuff I'm not sure if we have or not, as well as the treasure chart buried stuff. But one I know we can go to next time. Uh, that's one I don't... Yeah. You know what? Uh, I know this outro's really awkward, but we're gonna do one more. Just for you guys, I know. I really shouldn't be spoiling you, but we'll do it anyway. Uh, it's just one last side quest that we have to do. One last, t one last tiny thing that I know is there, and that is on Headstone Island, but we're going out to because it's next to Headstone Island. And I'll do that, and then the next part I'll probably start on one of the bigger, more daunting side quests. Ugh. Man, this outro is so awkward. It wasn't even. It turned from a really awkward outro into continuing on with the video. That's friggin' movie magic for you. Turn it into whatever the frick you want, anytime you want, and do not take action for your consequences. Or something like that. It's something along those lines. Probably stupider. Anyway, fast forward. So up here we got a secret submarine. Hopefully I haven't already been to this submarine, otherwise I'm gonna look like a total idiot. Yeah. Please tell me we haven't been here before. Yeah, we haven't been here before. I remember because there's a bunch of rats with a bunch of bombs and it's total chaos and horrible and very difficult to do without taking damage. Or otherwise being hindered in some way. Because there's just bombs everywhere. Literally. They just constantly pick them up and throw them at you. Get back here, you little sneaks. You can't really slash your sword because you'll blow up bombs every time you do it. So you just kind of have to throw your boomerang one at a time. You'll get them eventually. Uh... Apparently the boomerang also sets off the bomb, but it does so much less often, except for that time where it apparently did it. No! Oh. Thankfully these are far enough away that they won't set off a chain reaction. That would just be horrible. What are these two doing? <laughs> just running around. I didn't even hit that one. How? I don't know. Yeah! There's a the thing! Up there. And we're gonna get it. I mean, it's probably a treasure chart. <sighs> Crush Link's head with that ladder. Probably a treasure chart. But we did see a treasure chart and a spiky chest, so maybe there's a piece of heart and a wood and metal chest. Maybe. Probably not. Maybe. Maybe, baby. Maybe, baby. Maybe, 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 maybe. maybe. Oh, yeah! Treasure chart! <laughs> Yeah. Alright, thanks for watching. That's how I play Legends of the Windmaker. Next time, uh, we can't visit the map. We'll go to Outset Island, get the last Triforce chart. Well, we probably won't get it, but we'll start on that quest. It's a very daunting quest. Not really at bothersome in the sense of, like, the Goron, Bigoron sword side quest. Uh, shut up, Tangry Lions. But it's very challenging still. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Later.